Where do I begin? We just hit 50,000 subscribers and I truly cannot believe it. I thank each and every viewer, each and every subscriber. You guys have supported me from the start of this channel, which has been only just one year and we've hit this amazing milestone. This is truly just the beginning, but I just want to say thank you guys so much from the bottom of my heart. You guys have changed my life. You guys enabled me to work on something that I truly love, which is making videos as well as making videos on something that I really love, which is artificial intelligence. This has been my goal since I was younger. I would always love to make videos on YouTube, but I would never gain success until this past year. And eventually I was able to get to this height where I've been able to make videos on a daily basis and push out something that you guys really love. Not only does it support me, but it's something that I live by, which is having other people gain benefits off of what I do. And it's something that I really want to keep striving towards where I push out good things, where I live by the code, which is in the joy of others lies their own. This is something that I try to push and try to help other people inspire as they do other sorts of tasks. And I truly wish that each and every one of you does that exact same thing. As a viewer of mine or someone who supports me, I truly wish that you also do the exact same thing where you push out good values, push out good positivity in this world, and you try to make a lasting impact in other people's lives. So now that is out of the way, let's take a look at today's video topic, which is introducing generative agents. And this is where computational entities are capable of simulating believable human behavior in interactive applications. They can resemble activities that are seen in simulations. And this is where I would like to introduce AI Town. This is something that would be familiar for the original viewers of this channel, where I've actually covered this project previously on the channel last year. Now, this is where it enables you to have an innovative architecture that leverages different large language models. And this is where they are deploying agents autonomously to perform daily routines, form relationships, and even engage in conversations within the sandbox environment. These are AI agents that are powered by different language models. And recently, the reason why we're covering this again is because you're going to be able to deploy these different agents by Llama 3, as well as various other language models. They have also introduced various upgrades to the sandbox, which is why we're going to be taking a look at it, showcasing how you can get started and what you can actually do with it. So with that thought, guys, let's get straight into the video. So what is this research paper? Well, it's a research paper that was actually developed by Stanford University, researchers at that university. And it's a project that is introducing generative agents within this interactive simulation. We're going to be able to deploy different agents that can perform various tasks. Now, they've done evaluation underscores, which is focusing on the importance where agents have memory, they have reflections, and they, where they even plan in shaping different behaviors. They emphasize their role in creating realistic simulations, and they basically perform actions like humans would in a, their own basic environment or wherever they are performing these actions. Now, beyond the technical advancements of this project, they have focused on prompt discussions as well as different considerations where they are focusing on advocating a responsible deployment of different agents. This is something that is quite close to what AGI is able to accomplish. We're giving general intelligence to these agents. You can actually take a look at AI Town on their cloud hosted version, which I'll leave a link to in the description below, as well as all the other links that I use in today's video. This is your virtual town where AI characters live, chat, and socialize. Now, if you were to see my prior video on AI town, I went on showcasing how you can install the backend as well as the front end. So if you're interested in that, definitely take a look. It's exactly the same, but now they just updated their interface, which is going to be showcasing the exact same steps as to how you can set it up. But you can see that this is your virtual town where all the AI agents are interacting. For example, we have two conversations happening at the same time. This is where Kurt is focusing on talking with this other AI agent. And these are AI agents that are deployed using different language models. You have Llama 3. You can also integrate GPT-4 as well as various other open source models. Now, if you want to play around with the agents, I truly recommend that you sign in or create an account with AI Town. Once you have done that, you can then head over and click on the interact tab. 
this will allow you to interact with AI agents within this deployable simulation. So you can see over here that you can click on this agent and you can start chatting around. So you can see that this is our agent. We can actually move around with it or you can tell it to click to a certain area and they will actually walk to that area. You can even have these AI agents do various tasks such as pick flowers. You can ask them to sit at the fire camp, go to your house, sleep, or even interact with these other agents so we're gonna go head over and talk to this agent so we have someone over here which is stella and you can actually start a conversation with this person so i'm waiting for her to accept the conversation and it looks like she is walking away but now she's walking back which is it's stating that she's gonna walk over now something cool to note is that these ai agents have their own personalities and they're basically developing these personalities as they interact within this environment they're picking up these traits as well as these different types of basic like perspectives as to how they would interact with other people and we can see that there is a note for this ai agent where stella can never be trusted she tries to trick people all the time normally into giving her money or doing things that will make her money so we can see that we can actually have a conversation with her so hey beyblade og which is my github name long time no chat how have you been anything exciting happening in your life recently and i can basically type in nothing much i just hit 50k i cannot type subs on youtube i know this is not relevant but it's just something i'm chatting and let's see what she's going to be able to say wow that's amazing congrats on reaching 50,000 subscribers what type of content do you create on your channel ai so I know I already have a video showcasing how you can install AI Ton, but there's actually an easier method where you can just use a one-click installer using Pinocchio. This is something that we've covered originally a long time ago on this channel, and we've actually showcased how you can install it. So if you're interested, I'll also leave a link to how you can install Pinocchio as well as other models locally on your desktop. But in this case, you can see that AI Town is over here, and you can just utilize their one-click installer to install it locally. Now, in this current moment, it's only for Mac and Linux only where you're going to be able to install it. So just keep that in mind. But it's fairly simple. You just want to install their application. Once you have installed Pinocchio, you can just simply open it up. Once that application is opened up, we're going to showcase how you can get started. So we're going to set this up on this computer. Once you have set it up, it's going to take a couple of minutes to actually install all the files that are needed to have this one click installer functional. So once this is finished, I'll be right back. And once it has finished installing everything, you can just simply click on the launch button and you're gonna be able to access the Pinocchio interface. This is where you can just simply click on the discover tab and you can click on AI town. You just simply click download and you're gonna be able to start installing this locally on your computer. You can even have it so that you can connect various language models such as Llama 3 so that you can have a fully stimulated environment that has AI agents interacting with other AI agents and basically operating within this own simulation. This is absolutely amazing. This is a research paper that I go further in depth, which I have made a video on. So if you're interested, definitely take a look at this video, which goes a lot more in depth onto the research paper and it showcases how you can develop this virtual AI environment. Sorry for being repetitive, but this month we had insane partnerships with big companies giving out subscriptions to AI tools completely for free. These are tools that will streamline your business's growth and improve your efficiency. Just being a patron this past month, you were given access to six paid subscriptions completely for free. Not only do you access these subscriptions, but you gain the ability for consulting, networking, collaborating with the community, as well as with myself. You get access to daily AI news, resources, giveaways, and so much more. If you're interested, check out the Patreon link in the description below to gain access to these benefits. Now, this is truly a remarkable project as you're going to be able to create your own simulation with AI agents. This is something that has been under development over the past year, and they do continuously upgrade and try to create something out of this. So I'll keep you guys posted as more things are being introduced. This is definitely something that you should take a look at as you can do various things and even have a simulation of your own world. So if you're interested, I'll leave all these links in the description below so that you can access it. Truly recommend that you take a look at my video on it because it goes more in depth as to what you can do with it, how you can accomplish certain things and how the architecture basically functions. So with that thought, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video, guys. 
I'll leave all the links as to what I use in today's video in the description below. Make sure you check out the Patreon page if you haven't already. This is a great way for you to access different subscriptions completely for free. Make sure you follow me on Twitter. Great way for you to stay up to date with the latest AI news. And lastly, make sure you guys subscribe, turn on the notification bell, like this video, and check out our previous videos so you can stay up to date with the latest AI news. But with that thought, guys, have an amazing day. Spread positivity, and I'll see you guys fairly shortly. Peace out, fellas.